What's up, everyone? Welcome back to the t a d r a d i o Communications Instructional Channel. In the face of large-scale power outages or other emergency situations, it is necessary to have a means to contact family members in a timely manner. So it is recommended that everyone create an emergency communication toolkit. So, how do you prepare? Let's take a look at the specific steps. First, prepare a transparent and waterproof plastic box to ensure that the contents of the kit are easy to store and view. Put in a radio that supports custom programming. It is best to support your HF and VHF bands. Visit the radio reference website to find and program key frequencies in advance, such as an OAA, fire and emergency frequencies, federal disaster frequencies, etc. Next. Put in a spare battery and charger, and make sure there are enough charging devices to turn on the radio. Give priority to radio with USB charging and flashlights, so that there is no need to put in a charging base and flashlight, saving space and weight, and further improving the portability and practicality of the kit. Finally, put in a brief card instruction. Record the set frequency on the card, and ensure that family members can quickly check it when needed. At the same time, inform the emergency operation process. In daily life, you can practice regularly with your family. Make sure that all family members are familiar with the operation of the radio before an emergency occurs, including selecting frequencies, initiating emergency communications, and how to contact family members in case of separation. Also, check the status of the walkie-talkie to ensure that they can work properly in an emergency. I hope this video can help you prepare before an emergency occurs, ensuring that you can quickly get in touch with family, friends, or rescue agencies at critical moments. If it helps you, please give us a like.